we've had crazy weather here lately. Really crazy. I, and well, everywhere it's been crazy. And uh, I just heard yesterday there were tornado warnings in New Jersey. Did you hear about that? 30 people had to take shelter under Snooky's poof. <laughs> 30. They're okay. Everyone's all right. Oh, it's been so hot in Los Angeles. I just tried to stay inside for the last few nights uh, and most of the year. But um, <laughs> we don't go out. We don't do anything. We have people over all the time. And uh, last night, Portia and I had a few people over. And whenever people come over to our house, they always say the same thing. Can I wear my shoes on the gold floor? <laughs> That's not the point of my story, though. Uh, the point is, so we have dogs. We have two dogs, Mabel and Wolf. And uh, whenever people come over, uh, they sniff them. The, the dogs sniff the people. The people... <laughs> that would be weird. <laughs> Uh, the, but the dogs sniff the people, and uh, people always say the exact same thing. Oh, they must be smelling my dog. They smell my dog. <laughs> and one of my friends says it every single time she comes over, and I never say anything, but I know she doesn't have a dog. <laughs> I know. <clears throat> I think if my dog is smelling your dog on you, maybe it's not something to announce and to be proud of, you know? <laughs> Either you have a smelly dog or it's time to wash your pants. <laughs> It's just what dogs do. They sniff. That's how they get to know someone. And cats are not like that. Cats are much more subtle. C cats will Google you. They will. <laughs> That's how they get their information. Well, I don't know why we have to explain everything that our pets do. You know, it's just sometimes we just should, a dog should just be a dog. They don't need a reason why they're sniffing. They're just sniffing. If your child is constantly sniffing people and humping their legs, then <laughs> that needs an explanation and maybe therapy.